Before we get into today's video, I've got three things for you. Number one, if you want to get a notification whenever we post a new video, make sure you ring that bell. Number two, there's a TCG Player affiliate link in the show notes. After clicking that link, every purchase you make on tcgplayer.com helps support this channel. Number three, you'll also find a link to our Patreon where you can support us directly. And now, kick back and enjoy the show. What's up, Spikes? We're back in the lovely Spike Feeder studio. The headquarters. The headquarters of the, the world. <laughs> um, we are coming at you today with uh, something a little different. We haven't done this in quite a while, but we are playing a casual game. Um, just a, a, a nice, fun with friends game of magic mm -hmm. uh, with powered down decks. They're not necessarily powered down, but they're powered down relative to what we normally play. Um, I think this deck is objectively powered down to most decks. Yeah, it's, <laughs> that's, that's like fair. So, uh, yeah, today I am playing Arixmithy's Slumbering Isle. Um, this is a Simic Sea Monsters deck featuring the Sea Monster himself, Arixmithy's Slumbering Isle. The uh, idea behind this deck is it is one-shot tribal, which means uh, Arixmithy's as a 12-12 will become a 24-24 at some point during this game if I'm doing my job. Uh, it uh, supplements that with a whole bunch of board wipes, especially ones that Eryxmethes can dodge, and then it's also got some fun land shenanigans in it as well. Nice. Uh, I'm also playing a tribal deck. I am playing Gishath, Sun's Avatar, uh, Dinosaur <laughs> slash uh, Extra Combat Spell Tribal. Uh, so I'm hopefully going to cast this 7-6 uh, with Trample, Vigilance, and Haste. Uh, put seven dinosaurs into play, and then cast a, a World at War, or a Waves of Aggression, or a Relentless Assault, or... Uh, Gratuitous Violence. <laughs> wow, that, that's oh, the savage. double damage. Savage Beating. Savage Beating. Savage Beating. Savage Beating. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, it's sh simple, short, sweet this time around. That's my deck. Hmm. I thought it was Gishath, but okay. It's, it's <laughs> Gishimple, Gishort, <laughs> Gishweet. Well, I don't like any of those things. <laughs> Uh, hello! I'm going third in turn order today, and I'm going to be playing uh, Kangi Airy Keeper, which uh, you obviously don't know what that card does because nobody does, so it'll be right here over Elliot's face. Now he has to edit it over his own face, and I'm it's very probably happy already over my face. Um, it is uh, not bird tribal, even though it references birds in its, uh, in its text. Uh, it is shapeshifter tribal or changeling, uh, changeling tribal. Nice try. Uh, it's like the same thing. There are a lot of shapeshifters <laughs> in this deck. Um, yeah, so it's just basically all creature types, all like the lords that care about certain creature types uh, and as many ways to get them to overlap as possible. Uh, in addition to a commander that is a real workhorse, uh, it, you'll you'll see in this in this game, it'll do a lot of work. Mm -hmm. And I will be going last, and I'm playing Kakar Winds Fury. Uh, this is a Commander's Quarters special. It's a budget brew. Nice. At the time I made the deck, it was $25, and it runs lots of enchantments. And we'll see how that goes. Nice. Also, and Maddie's here. Yeah. yeah. Also, this yeah. is yeah. You guys remember Maddie, Maddie right? Yeah. Clover Altars on our Discord. Yeah. yeah. And everywhere. Instagram. Resident, everywhere. <laughs> Resident, Resident insanely <laughs> talented person. Yeah. Thanks, man. Okay. Thanks, well, man. Can we start it up? <laughs> Let's get started. Let's. Uh, I'm going to draw a card. <clears throat> I'm going to play this breeding pool tapped, and I'm going to cast once upon a time. <laughs> Who approved this card? <laughs> I would like to look at the top five cards in my library, reveal a creature or a land card from among them, and put it into my hand. I'm going to get this strip mine. Oh, no. And I will put the rest on the bottom in a random order. Did you know that you can strip mine your own command? I don't know if that was random. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll pass the turn. I'll draw for my turn then. That's how magic works. Uh, I'm going to play a Marsh Flats. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and pass the turn. I knew it. Uh, I'm going to play this Flooded Strand and also pass the turn. I will draw for my turn. And I'm going to play this mountain, and one of these decks is severely more budget than the other ones. <laughs> and pass the turn. Okay, uh, tap. Draw a card. Uh, I am going to play this strip mine that you guys for sure didn't know anything about. You should strip what? mine Madison's Mountain. <laughs> oh. I'll just scoop him up now, it's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome back. If he does that to yeah, the show. Welcome back to the show. Are you having fun now? <laughs> 
I'm going to cast Into the North. Ooh. Oh, Shout out to Into the North podcast. Yeah. Uh, I have a response. Yeah, do it. Uh, I'm going to crack this so that we can search at the same time. I have a response, actually. Uh, oh. I'm going to crack this so that we can search three at the same oh, time. I have a response, too. I'm not going to crack this, though. That's okay. okay. So mine resolves first off of my hot flood. It's right. I'm going to get a hollowed fountain. Elliot, off of my marsh flats, I'm going to get a temple garden. Off of my Into the North, I'm going to get a snow-covered island. Matt? I just have a mountain. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to pass the turn. I'm gonna untap and draw. Uh, it matches my playmat. It does. Oh. Um, mine doesn't, and this next one that I play also isn't because my commander is a Naya commander. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna play a plateau, and uh, I'll pass the turn. Untap plateau. <laughs> plateau. <laughs> oh, that's a that's a workhorse. Uh, I'm going to play a tundra. Don't keep saying that. <laughs> Sinew sliver. That's not a horse at all. <laughs> it could be. Mm -hmm. uh, so this is a one mana or two mana one one. Uh, all slivers get plus one plus one. It is a sliver, so it's a two two. I'm gonna pass the turn. Wow, that's crazy. Neat. Crazy. I'll draw for my turn. Thanks, Madison. <laughs> she like to be a team player. You know, I'm gonna play this planes for the turn, and then I'm gonna cast an impact tremors. Ooh. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield under my control, it deals one damage to each opponent. That's, that's gonna us. kill us. I'm your nice. opponent. That's so me. We're friends, right? <laughs> Okay, I'm right. going to attack. I want to draw a bird. Uh, play this snow-covered forest. I'm going to cast this grow spiral. Okay. Mm -hmm. Draw a card. And then be real sad because I don't have a land in my hand to put onto the battlefield. Oh. Uh, think once. <laughs> then I will uh, <laughs> cast this rampant growth. Oh, that's cool. Oh. I don't have a fetch to respond with yeah, this time. Yeah, me neither. So I can yeah. resolve my if you want to, growth. I guess. Mm -hmm. Gonna get this snow covered forest, mm -hmm. and I'll pass the turn. I'm gonna draw. Not, not going anywhere quickly this game, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna play a savanna, oh. and I'm gonna pass the turn. On tap. Draw a card. Um. I think the play is just this this boy, this lad. Uh, I'm going to play a planes and tap for two, uh, specifically a blue and a white, I suppose, and I'm going to cast Standard Bearer. Oh, no. Uh, so if an opponent plays a spell or ability that can target a flag bearer in play, that player chooses at least one flag bearer as a target. Tell me, Bill, is Standard Bearer a flag bearer? Uh, creature dash, yes. Okay. Yeah. Creature um, dash, yes, not flag bearer. Creature dash, yes. I'm <laughs> going to move down. to combat, and I'm uh, going to attack Elliot for two with this Sinew Sliver. I will go to 37. Yeah, you will. I'm sad about it, but not that sad. And I'll pass the turn to Maddie. Okay. I will untap and draw a card for the turn. I would like to play another planes. Ooh. And then I would like to play a gutter snipe. Ooh. Triggering my Trigger. <laughs> Trigger. No. Trigger. Uh, I go to 36, Bill goes to 38, James goes to 39. It begins. This is going to be And then rough. I will pass the turn. Uh-oh. Oh, time. Wow. Maybe I should have stripped Minder Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> she could have really played either of those cards if you did. Yeah. No. That's crazy. Wow, if she casts like a Krenko's command right now, we're like actually dead. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm going to play a snow-covered forest. Hmm, I've got six mana, you say. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to cast this Euro. Oh. And ETB, trigger, trigger. Yep. I'm mm -hmm. going to stack them such that uh, I gain three life and draw a card first. Uh, then the sacrifice trigger will resolve. Yep, so you get 42. 42. Yep, I also do not have a land to put into play. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> And I think I'm going to pass the turn. Alrighty. Uh, I'll draw for my turn. I'm going to play a taiga uh, to complete my trifecta. Also, please, nobody play a blood moon. Uh, pass the turn. Okay. On tap. Draw for my turn. What? <laughs> <laughs> this, uh, this deck plays a lot of very interesting cards. <laughs> I'll say that much. Um, I will play an island, and do I want to cast this card? 
<laughs> is this card good? I yeah. Don't know. Yeah, this card's sweet. Uh, I'm going to play Mistform Mask, uh, targeting Standard Bearer. Uh, so it is an enchantment, uh, and it's an aura. And uh, I can pay one colorless to change enchanted creature's type to the creature type of my choice until end of turn. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, so I would like to uh, pay one to turn it into a sliver until end of turn. Uh -huh. yep. Combat, attack Elliot for four. <laughs> uh, yeah, 32. <laughs> Uh, Seems rude. James mm -hmm. is on the throne. Pass. This is okay. a standard. Bear Maddie's now. got the only <laughs> other permanence in the flag. And draw for my turn. I will play this mountain. And What's it I like will... having two thirds of a perfect mana base? It's really nice, except that I don't have the perfect mana base. <laughs> Tap two to cast a Sizzit Signet. Oh, she has a perfect mana base! Perfect! Wow, what's it like? I play all the cards that I want. <laughs> <laughs> and then I think I'm going to pass the turn. Okay, I want to. I can play all the cards that I want Draw later. Card. Except that I can't right now. <laughs> I'm going to play this Wasteland. Oh wow. my goodness. Jeez. Uh, then I'm going to cast this land. Oh, wow. It enters the yeah, battlefield with tapped. five slumber counters. Five slumber counters on it. <clears throat> and tapped. And tapped. <laughs> He's slumbering. I'm he obviously. is slumbering. Shh. He's sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll pass the turn. I will draw for my turn. Uh, I'm going to play this Temple of the False God. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, it is online. Uh, I'm going to play this Mana Vault. Oh, with one colorless floating. <clears throat> I'm going to cast Gishath, Sun's Avatar. Yep. I would like <sighs> to respond. <laughs> oh my goodness. Sipina. It's okay. I would like to frantic search. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, trigger so gutter snake. Right? Trigger gutter snake. We each take two. I go to 30. Bill goes to 36. James goes back to his starting life total. Maddie is also at her starting okay, life total. Okay, so I will draw two cards. I will discard. Please have drawn into like an essence. This scatter. Boros locket, and I will discard this Terramorphic Expanse, Perfect. and then I will untap three lands. Yes. James, any effects? Um. No. Okay. That's bad he us. comes into play. I would like to move to combat. <laughs> Attack, James! Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I oh. didn't really think about that oh. for very long. I have effects. Oh. Uh oh. 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 I'm going to cast Mystical Tutor, Trigger Uric Smithies. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, off of this Mystical Tutor, I'm going to get Crush of Tentacles <laughs> to the top, and then I will uh, declare no blockers. <clears throat> Blah. Please take some. Go to 33. Trigger Gishath, Sun's Avatar. I will reveal the top seven cards in my library. Please whiff. Thundering Spineback, Ripjaw Raptor, Forest, <laughs> Wayward Swordtooth, Ranging Raptors, oh, an extra turn or extra combat spell, and Colossal Dreadmaw. Huh. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Does it go to your hand or do they go into play? They go, go into play. play. Yeah. It's okay. That's you're going to. I thought you said you were going to take seven cards and put them into play. No, I'm going to reveal. That looks like five. Well, <laughs> you know. Are you Eggers, a liar, Elliot? Beggars can't Feels be choosers. Feels bad. Well, Feels it's bad. not going to when James casts this Crash of Tentacles. That's my plan. Uh, I can play an additional land on each of my turns. Oh, also I have the City's Blessing. <laughs> there we go. I've got the City's Blessing? Great. Uh, I'm going to play this Plains. And uh, I'm going to pass the turn. Right. Uh, Madison, I have a question for you. Do you run yes. board wipes? Yes. By any chance. Okay. I do. Can you uh, be cool and let me do something? I need to hit you with this, uh, this standard uh. <laughs> Just, like, it will deal one damage to you. Bill's going to exploit your knowledge. <laughs> it will get rid of all of this. Anyway, while like, you decide, might be a fair trade. I'm gonna play a planes. Uh, right. I'm gonna tap the planes for a soul ring. Yep. And then uh, I'm going to move to combat and attack you with standard. Why are you attacking me? Actually, 
I can attack James. <laughs> yeah, attack James for one. I'll kill everything you I don't even need to make the choice now. I like yeah. that. Yeah, no uh, Okay, before damage, I'm going to use this planes to turn this standard bearer into a rogue. rogue. Yeah. Call yeah. shot. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, James takes one. Take one. Uh-huh. 32. Uh, 32. Welcome to an even footing, brother. Uh, and then, yeah, I'm going to tap four and uh, prowl this knowledge exploitation targeting Maddie. Uh, so I'm going to attempt to search your library for an instant or sorcery card. I can play it without paying its money. I'm going to hope I didn't lie to you then. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to exploit the knowledge of a blasphemous act uh, to destroy all, or to deal 13 damage to each creature. Which, which is, incidentally destroys all creatures. Which is enough to destroy all creatures. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, I will trigger uh, Ranging Raptors and Ripjaw Raptor. Uh, oh, oh. Sorry, I'm just thinking oh. before my gutter snipe dies. You know what? No, it's okay. Oh, okay. okay. It's okay. Uh, yeah, so I'll trigger both of these. I will have the ranging raptors uh, search Thanks. resolve first. Uh, off of my ranging raptors trigger, I'm going to get a basic forest. Mm -hmm. And then off of my ripjaw raptor trigger, draw a card. Okay. okay. I, have have no, I have no further effects, okay. and it will continue passing the turn. Oh, it's my turn, Madison. Yes. Thank you. I will take my turn. I'm At least now, card. James's Crush of Tentacles doesn't do anything to me. Ooh. Yeah, I wanted oh to God. use that for a different blue spell, blue but it doesn't do anything to me Five either. So things in play. Okay, so for four mana, I will cast Kikar, mm -hmm. and then you guys take damage. Yes. Oh, yes. Yep. Yeah, 29. So I'll go to 35. And I'm at 31. Okay. Perfect. And then I would like to cast this Intangible Virtue. <laughs> Mm. Trigger. trigger. Oh yeah, trigger Kaikar. And trigger Impact and then Tremors. trigger Impact Tremors. Yeah, so <sighs> 28, 34, 30. And then I will pass the turn. Okay, I'll untap. Wow. Are those professional tokens? Yeah. Did you get those from Wizards of the Coast? Uh, draw this crush of right? tentacles. They're super like, top secret. Yeah. <laughs> Spoiled only on the spike feeders. <laughs> hmm. I've got seven mana. Uh, eight, nine. A lot more than Ooh. that. <laughs> That's a lot of mana. That's a lot of mana. That's a lot of mana. Uh, I'm going to cast <laughs> this. <laughs> Sorry. I'm going to cast... Uh, what is that? That's five. five. Make that six. I'm going to cast Thunderfoot Bailoth. Uh-oh. Oh. Yep. You do have your commander. It's a big... Big boy. Green boy. It's gonna make all of the other uh, boys trigger Eryxmethes. Mm. Is it just whenever you cast a spell? Spell. Oh yeah. Oh. Um. Then I'm gonna cast this Rancor on my Thunderfoot Bailoff. <laughs> yep. Trigger Eryxmethes. Yep. And yep. I'll pass the turn. Oh uh, good. I will untap. Uh, in my upkeep, I will take one off of my Mana Bolt. And I'm going to draw for my turn. Oh, that would have been good last turn. Uh, I'm going to play this ancient tomb. Uh, uh, and I'm going to take two that's Gishath, to 25 and uh, cast Gishath, Sun's Avatar. I definitely tried. That's why I made this a 7-5. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it still would have killed uh, oh, no. Effects? Uh, no. no. Effects, effects. Oh, yeah, still would have done the... Still would have killed the commander, because yeah. I do control my commander. It just happens <laughs> to be a land. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to move to combat. Yep. Uh -huh. Bill. Yeah. Uh, please take seven. Yep. Go to 27. Trigger, Nisha. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We've got... Uh, Arid Mesa, Windswept Heath, Forest, Soul Ring, Misty Rainforest, Death Gorge, Scavenger, and Raging Regisaur. Oh, Reggie. Uh, this isn't when it enters, it's only when he attacks, but this one is when it enters. Uh, I'm an exile target card from a graveyard. If a creature card ex ex is exiled this way, I gain two life. And if a non-creature card is exiled, uh, he gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. So I will exile your Sinew Sliver, You, you William. got it. And go to mm -hmm. 27. He is Theros Beyond Dead. <laughs> I'm going to pass the turn. Okay, hunt out. <laughs> uh, draw. 
I think this is probably fine. Let's see what happens. Uh, one, two, three, four, uh, let's say five with that. Uh, blue, blue. Uh, I'm going to cast Telemann Performance targeting Elliot DeWick. <laughs> You're not going to exile many cards, but you might get something sweet. I hope I get something Until I reveal a creature? Hold yep. up. Oh, Hold up. Yeah, I have or, any effects. No effects. What do you think? Just because this is a casual game of magic, we could just throw caution to the wind? Are we throwing caution to the wind? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so I yeah. exile them? And uh, they just say reveal. Exile them. No, you just reveal. Oh, okay. Uh, mountain. Unclaimed territory. Majestic Damn. Heliopterus. Ah. What happens to these? Uh, they get put into your graveyard. Yeah, that player puts all non-creature Sad. cards to reveal this one because they're a graveyard. Uh, I have a 2-2. Two -two. I'm going to pass the turn. <laughs> <laughs> it <Okay>. flies. <laughs> Box Kaikar. At the end of the turn, I would like to exile a white card from my hand instead of paying the mana cost for this. Oh, and I no. would like to play Force of Virtue. Oh, no. Exile oh, a white wow. card turn. We all take one. Uh, Hold she, on. Hold on. well, Kaikar triggers. So, yeah, Kaikar yeah, does so triggers. Kaikar triggers. We so she makes a spirit. So I make a spirit, and then one. impact tremors triggers. 26 for me, 26 so for Bill, 29 Do for these. James. Then you may have responses to Force of Virtue, Jimothy. Uh, I would like to swan song it. Oh, it is an enchantment. I see. <sighs> I mean, he's just yeah, giving you more yeah, birds. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He's giving you a token that gets plus one, plus one in vigilance, and then also we take another damage. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> 25. 25, 25, and 28. 20, 28. Mm -hmm. I don't have any birds. Oh, so I do. Here is a two bird. I think, uh, I think this is maybe the worst dinosaur I could have gotten out of your deck. <laughs> uh, yeah, but you could have got like Autopack Hunt Master or something. That's my here. <laughs> okay, I will start my turn. Okay. Oh, a uh, trigger for Rick Smithies. Oh my goodness, we're it's all over the place. No. Everybody take a deep breath. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody take a deep breath. <laughs> <laughs> Can I keep going? Oh, yeah, yeah, please do. Please do. <laughs> Let's move past this. <laughs> hmm. Do you have no cards in there? Well, I you have, have one. one, I just now? drew a card. Wow. Isn't that nice? Where do they all go? <laughs> uh, I would like to move to combat. I have no have flying flyers, walkers. So Neither does James. To attack Elliot. Oh my goodness. Uh, one, two, three, four, four five, three, six, seven. Five. This is two. I have two of these. Yeah, they're two, two. Four. Twos, yeah. Oh yeah, seven. Yeah, this is seven. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Yeah, no effects. Eighteen goes to eight. Gemini. And then I will play this murmuring mystic. Whenever I cast an instant or sorcery, I make a bird. Uh, make a oh. void. I'm a big fan of the name Murmuring Mystic because it implies that they just walk around going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I'm for. <laughs> 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 and then just birds fly out. Fast. I apologize to anybody that had to read the captions for that. <laughs> Sorry. I probably have to caption it. It feels bad. <laughs> you brought this upon yourself. Oh, yeah. no. I'm going to draw a card. What is this rank or placement? <laughs> no, it's pants. He's wearing them on his head. <laughs> I think I'm going to uh, oh tap these two. I'm going to cast Nature's Lore. Mm -hmm. Trigger Eric Smithies. Guess who's awake? Yep. Wakey, wakey. Roar. Eggs and bakey. Sorry. <laughs> I've got this tropical island. Oh, it's Nature's Lore. It's the good one. Whoa. Yeah. Untapped. Untapped. That's wild. Untapped. That's value. Okay. Speaking of untapped... Well, speaking, all of those lines are speaking of untapped. Uh, I'm going to cast Pemenzora on Eric Oh no! Oh, he has infinite that, green yeah, mana. that just makes infinite green mana. Yeah. Yes, it does. Oh, uh, I, facts. I have no facts. No facts. I Madison. have no facts. This is bad. Yeah, this is. I thought I was doing okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, I'm going to move to combat. Yo. Okay. Um, Elliot. Uh, 14 with Trample. Uh, hmm. No effects. Okay. I will go to four. Uh, pass the turn. Uh, I will untap. Oh man, you can just untap. <laughs> um, <laughs> Shh. 
yeah, trigger this mana vault. I will very much untap it, please. Tap your ancient tomb for it. No, father. <laughs> <laughs> I will draw for my turn. Uh, so I'm going to go to combat, and uh, I'm going to declare Gishath uh, as an attacker at Bill, and Death Gorge Scavenger uh, as an attacker at Maddie. Uh, trigger Death Gorge Scavenger. Uh, so I will exile uh, Bill's flag bearer guy. <laughs> Standard bearer down. You got it. Mm -hmm. uh, to go to six life. Uh, yeah, and then you guys may uh, block or whatever. I'm sorry, what does it do? It is just a three two. Just a three two. Yeah, yeah I'll block. <laughs> Great. You may have first. Oh, wait. So oh, Bill, just yeah, a three I'm, two. I'm, five. Yep, I am currently de uh, declaring that as a block. I will block. Sure. sure. Yep. Uh, okay. So. They bounce off each other, and then I will take you take five. five. Uh, <laughs> and I will reveal the top five cards of my library. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. They are Fires of Yavamaya, Mountain, Waves. Oh, why am I putting them in the graveyard? That's not how it works. <laughs> waves of Aggression and Bloodstained Mire, and a Crested Herd Caller. Uh, so when it enters, I will make a 3-3 green dinosaur creature token with Trample. Oh. Rawr. 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 It brings a friend. Polite. Rawr. Rawr. Um, Rawr. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to cast, uh, taking two life off of this ancient tomb. Go to four. Go to four again. Uh, for nine mana, I'm going to cast an Apex Altasaur. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's a 9 mana 10 10. When it enters the battlefield, it fights up to one target creature I don't control. And then uh, whenever it is dealt damage, it fights up to one target creature I don't control. Uh, mm -hmm. I, when it enters, I would like to have it fight Murmuring Mystic. Oh, I see. Oh. <laughs> uh, fight, 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 yeah. fight. Yeah. <laughs> so Murmuring Mystic will die a yeah. tragic death, and this guy will have one damage on him and trigger Enrage. Uh, I would like to fight Kaikar, Winds Fury. What did he ever do to you? Well, he's gonna kill me. <laughs> if I he's damage. just living his happy fireball life, okay? Uh, so uh, Kaikar is gonna die. Uh, he's gonna have four damage marked on it and trigger again. I'm going to fight the bird Which token. One? Oh. There's this one, the other <laughs> one's the not bird. a bird? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so he is going to have seven. Uh, it is going to fight one of your spirits. Oh. Uh, it is going to go to nine damage and then it is going to fight this guy. Oh. Yep. Yep. Uh, now he is going to die. Rancor goes to my graveyard and then to my hand. Yes, sir. Um, I'm going to play a mountain as my land for turn and uh, organize this mess that I've got going on. Go ahead, Bill. Okay. Untap. Uh, draw a card. Interesting. Uh, two, three, four. This. Why is this card so good, James? Uh, what card does he have? I'm going to, this is two, blue, white, two, one, two. What? Kangi X Kangi. equals two. <laughs> oh. Okay. So all birds yeah. get plus two, plus two. All because birds. that's how cards used to be templated. Yeah. <laughs> this is all Wish birds. I had that bird back. Yeah. I paid uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight for a... It is a it is a bird, right? It is a bird. Yeah. Okay, it's a so bird it's a wizard. Four, four. It's a bird wizard. Yeah, actually. it's a four four um, bird flyer. Bird wizard. Uh, yeah, that was a bad rate to cast that card, but I'm going to pass the turn. Right. <laughs> wow, it's a four four that Will gets your whole board double anthem. Yeah, and that's like reasonable. His, his big board. <laughs> I would like to recast Kakar. Trigger uh, yep. impact. No, <laughs> this is a bird. <laughs> uh, yep, I will go to three. I would like to. Attack, Elliot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I will go to one. Very good. I would like to play this land and then pass the turn. Okay. Uh, on your end step, um, I would like to strip mine Ooh. your island. Which one? The untapped one. Oh. oh. I see. Uh -oh. Oh. I think he's going to attempt to win the entire game. He might. I'm going to drop her all at once. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I would like to propose a loop. Yes. I'm going to tap Eric Smithies. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. 
for uh, green and a blue. Yep. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to pay a blue to untap it. Mm -hmm. mm. I would like to repeat this process until I have approximately, no, wait, exactly 100,000 green mana. Okay. Uh -huh. Sure. Okay. Then I'm going to tap a blue. Oh, he needs another blue. <laughs> and cast Hydroid Crasis. <sighs> X equals a bunch. Uh, How much is a bunch? Uh, I assume it's two uh, times. Such that. I'm going to need you to pick a, a number. <laughs> okay, well, give me a second. I got to count some cards here. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> uh, hang on. I'm not going to get that aggressive. We'll save that many. Okay. Okay. X is going to be 120. Okay. That will allow me to gain 60 life, draw 60 cards. That's my 60 cards right there. We counted, don't worry. Yep. And uh, I'm going to put a whole bunch of counters on this big boy. <laughs> Approximately uh, 120. 120. <laughs> oh, come on, guys. Let's be. You guys. Come on, guys. Let's be civil. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> 120. Okay. I'm going to uh, tap Eryxmethes to add green and blue to my pool. Mm -hmm. Tap the breeding pool for another blue. And cast evacuation. All oh, just creatures. Uh, yeah, I have uh, no effects. Me neither. Okay. This, this game is game back in my hand. Sweep. Okay, I would then like to tap a, another blue. Cast this hydroid crisis. This time, X equals thirty-six. Okay. Uh, okay, we got a little life. Yeah, so you gain, I gain half that. 18. Okay. Draw 18, which just so happens to be the number of cards remaining five. in my library. Must mm -hmm. be nice. 105 life. <laughs> I, guess it's, I guess it's unfortunate that the card that you needed was in that bottom 18 cards. <laughs> yeah. 30. Okay. Six. Then I'm going to cast Goreclaw, Terror mm -hmm. of Calcisma. I'm going to cast Ronus the Indomitable. Ooh. That's online. It's like not yet. Yeah. Is it? Power oh, power. power. I thought it was like a... <laughs> oh, yeah. It's very much online. Oh, yeah. And then, if you'll indulge me. I, what if we don't? Then I'm going to cast this Finale of Devastation. Oh. <laughs> what would you like X to be? Uh, I would like X to be 6,000. Oh. Well, but there aren't any creatures in your library. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah. I'm going to look from my graveyard. <laughs> That's and what that card does. I'm going oh. to put Thunderfoot Bayloth oh, directly trample. into play. Yep. yep. Then I'm going to cast God Eternal Ronus. <laughs> yep. And then I'll move to combat. So, sorry, this is a 6,036. Yeah. Doubled. Doubled. Uh, doubled. 12,072. 12, 12, 72. Yeah. And then. <laughs> well, wait. Well, hang on. Move to combat. Right, right? I'm not watching. <laughs> move to combat. <laughs> move to combat. Do this hack. <laughs> All of you. Uh, I, can I choose to be hit by the 12,000? Yes. You, you can send these two those ways, but... Uh, I mean, I'm at 19, so... Uh, no, I would like the Ronus and the Ronus, thank you. <laughs> okay, the I'll, take, the I'll take the bear and the beast. The bear yeah. and the beast? Yeah, we're Battle dead. Galactica. <laughs> we're dead. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, Man, sure. I was supposed to be the big dude's deck. Yeah, yeah me too. I was gonna know, play the Synapse Sliver. Do you know who, uh, created this deck? This monstrosity? Well, obviously not you. It was not me, actually. It was um, Charlotte from the Commander Advisory Group. Oh. Uh, so at JQL Girl on oh, Twitter, yeah. if you want to blame Discord. her for this, she is in our Discord. You yeah. could add her there too. Um, I do blame her. Thanks. Yeah, a if lot. you want to yeah, blame thanks her for that. nothing. <laughs> so I hope I uh, did your deck some justice there, Charlotte. Uh, it is sweet. What else could you sweet. have possibly asked for? Yeah, I got to cast Finale of Devastation. Have you ever cast that card? No, I have actually. It's I, I have not, unfortunately. Really? Yeah. Oh, it's I didn't own a foil one until recently, so it wasn't in any of my decks. I think <laughs> when I played uh, Foon Chain Corvold, I was Foon able chain. to... Foon Chain. <laughs> Foon Chain. Uh, when I played Foon Chain Corvold, I was able to Finale of Devastation for Mayhem Devil. Uh, That's good. And it was it was very That's good. I had a lot of good. treasures in play. Yeah. <laughs> That's, yeah. That's wow. <laughs> Uh, yeah, my deck did what it was supposed to do two and a half times, kind of, right? Um, it was funny, I showed them off camera after I, well, I think I said it too, after I 
uh, had the mana to cast Gishath, that turn I drew the Apex Altasaur, mm. which is like the biggest feel bad. It's like, oh, I could have gotten this nine mana ten ten into play for free. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah. Yeah, the deck is very weak to uh, interaction. Uh, blasphemous act. <laughs> uh, blasphemous act. The turn after the Blasphemous Act, I actually drew Asceticism, which wouldn't have mm. saved anything because <laughs> it was the turn that I cast the Gishath, mm. but it's in You there. need like Vigor or something like that. Yeah. Does that you... turn off uh, Enrage? Uh, it does. It prevents yeah, damage. Yeah, it, it prevents prevent damage. Them. So yeah, maybe um, that's no problem. I also play like Boros Charm. Yeah. <laughs> well, that and that the, sometimes um, has the mode of Indestructible. There's mm -hmm. the dinosaur that reduces damage to your dinosaur. Yeah, Temple also Yeah, mm -hmm. That one's um, a good card. really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah. 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 How'd Kangi feel? Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was in a rough spot. Yeah, Admittedly I, playing the weakest deck at the yeah, table. I didn't sure. really draw anything that made my uh, slivers relevant, but I was able to attack with a standard bearer. So <laughs> I, I consider that. You standard turned it into a rogue and got a blast from that and killed me. Yeah, actually, yeah. Standard yeah. bearer... Um, Held me back a little bit because mm -hmm. it uh, kept me from playing this Rancor. Ah, well, yeah, that that's funny. Like you would have had to put the Rancor on. Yeah, the I think uh, I might have to go check the tape, but I think I might have been able to get a Rixmithies online one turn earlier by playing the Rancor on Maddie's creatures. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I didn't have yeah. any creatures at the time. Yeah. But I think I'm. I, I'm not actually sure if that would have worked out, but it was something I was thinking about anyway. Yeah, it's neat. What, what about Krakar? Krakar was fine. Like, I think it has a lot of really good interaction for a budget deck. Like, for a $25 deck, it was really good, I think. Mm -hmm. You can optimize it really cheaply just with adding some lands. Your rollout was sweet, too, yeah, right? Yeah, like it was Kaikar, yeah. Gutter Snipe, and Bat Tremors. Yeah, it was great. Was the lack of blue holding you back uh, more Not than Not really. Like, I think it did by a turn. By one turn. Mm -hmm. And then it was fine. Yeah. Because I think, like, I played the Signet, but I couldn't actually activate the Signet the same turn that I played it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you so, had the Island the next turn. Then, yeah. So. So then it was fine. Mm -hmm. yeah. well, all right. Yeah, yeah, you guys saw uh, everything in my deck. So. <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> oh, I, drew, I drew not enough. Oh, I absolutely, I absolutely did. That's yeah. too bad. Yeah. So uh, I think with that, um, we're going to catch you next week. Uh, next week is our season finale. It is. So uh, don't despair. I know that that's tempting, but don't do it. <laughs> uh, we are going to be taking a six week break. Sorry, not after this episode, after the next episode. Yes. So yeah. next week is our last episode for six weeks or so. It's a good we'll one. Though. Back. It's, it's definitely a really good one. stay tuned. Yeah. No yeah, spoilers. You definitely want to watch next week. But Mark it on tuned. your calendars next Thursday. Right. Yeah. They always do. Right. 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 <laughs> right. <laughs> Hey, thanks for checking out the Spike Feeders on YouTube. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure you click that subscribe button. And you can click this link to check out our other great videos.